What's going on guys, it's Laz here, and I'm playing a little bit of Hardpoint and Hijack. Now, a little bit of difference with this game mode. Uh, I'm actually playing the Mosh Pit series, or the League game in, uh, League Play, sorry, in Call of Duty Black Ops. It's a, uh, separate little mode off the side of the multiplayer. So, uh, you, you I'm not 100% sure, but I do think your kills and stuff do go towards your multiplayer, uh, totals. I do believe that does happen, uh, as I... Check that on mine, and yes, they did move when I got extra kills and stuff. Um, however, it's completely separate from the actual multiplayer game, like I said. And it's actually quite fun, because what it is, is you get five games up front first, where you have to play, and it, it assesses your playing ability, your style, um, it goes off your KD, uh, the, way you, the way you play the, play, play the game as well, and... Um, this game mode really does, once you get into it, it promotes playing the objective. You're going to sit back and camp and you don't help your team win, you don't get any points. Um, so it really does play, pay to play the objective, like uh, hard point now what you're seeing is really important to play the objective. Get the win, because you get, I think, 250 points for a win, uh, you remove your rank up as well uh, by doing so. and. Uh, it really helps your whole team out so and every time uh, it's you can't actually you can we tried it you can go in with a team but you get broken up straight away so you're gonna have to keep regrouping and and doing it like that there is a group one a, a team uh, mosh pit I suppose it was not team mosh pit it's actually uh, let me have a look it's a champions championships or champion series which is um not too bad. Um, it's a, all all that is is a mixture of objective-based modes. Uh, you can do a team or solo rank. Uh, I recommend doing it as a team, uh, getting a team of guys together and going in and doing it because uh, I saw some guys in the in the mosh pit series. I think it was meant to only be for solo only, but people were taking uh, clans in and they were just dominating. Now the other thing I found too was when I was in that section where you were getting evaluated and getting put into your uh, series or your class or your level of uh, ability. Uh, I ended up getting into, I think, the silver class. I think there's about four or five different classes. Uh, six, actually. You got your, your top tier, you got your top silver tier, your top bronze tier, you got your middle tier, gold and so forth, metal, uh, middle and then you got your, your noobs obviously the people that don't play much now what I found was a lot of guys I was looking up on their their rankings on the actual multiplayer afterwards and they're all like prestige 10 some of the guys are prestige 10 and like really high prestiges and really really uh, obviously good players and what they were doing was is a term classed in uh, Australian football league or Australian rugby rules uh, or AFL as you will whatever it is uh, it's called tanking it's where you, obviously they're playing really bad to get into the lower grades so that they can just absolutely rape and, you know what I mean, like they, it's kind of a real dog act to do that, but I mean, if that's what they want to do, then fine, you know, they're only going to, you know, it'll get boring after a while just completely raping people, I mean, if they're little kill whores and, and that, and they just really want to just, you know, destroy people, then whatever, but I mean, it just takes the fun out of the game, and the whole point of it is to get you in with a level playing class so that you're in with people that are at your level so it makes the game fun and enjoyable so you're not always going to win you're not going to dominate either you're always going to be just winning by a little bit or you're just going to lose by a little bit it's never going to be a massive margin however what I found was once I did get into this I actually got in like I said I was in the silver class I had a lot of teams that were in the silver class and they were just wiping the floor with us so uh, you could get we got a few good guys in there. I mean, I was I'm struggling at the moment playing core mode because of the, the lack of hit detection and and so on and so forth. Uh, however, I am starting to enjoy the game a bit more. I do really like this side of the game. Um, it's quite enjoyable uh, getting the ranking out of. Uh, I think each one has. I think the one I'm in's got about 250 to 300 people in that. Uh, class and I think it does get broken up into other smaller groups as well obviously it, it depends on where you are in the country uh, where you live obviously I'm in Australia so I'm getting broken up into groups of 200 250 to 300 people into a group and the one that I'm actually in at the moment I'm doing the mosh pit series and I'm actually in the silver division and the subdivision of that I'm pretty sure was bullet one plus something I don't know I don't know exactly what it is 
Oh, excuse me. It's actually, yeah, so Silver Division, I'm in the Havoc, Subdivision of Havoc 1-5, so I don't know what's going on there. I don't know how it works, but um, <laughs> roughly, yeah, guys, there's a whole bunch of them. Um, so I'm actually ranked 88 at the moment out of, what have we got, 200 and... There's about 230, 240 people playing now. It's, it's, yeah, it is very enjoyable, and it does vary from time to time as well on how many people are actually on. So it's not like a, your, your normal game battles games where you got to put a team together. You got to say, okay, look, our first team battle game is at three o'clock on Saturday afternoon. Everyone's got to be online, ready to go. At, at, fucking 2.30, you know what I mean? This is a real laid-back version of that. Obviously, you're not going to win prizes or money or, you know, anything like that, but it's an enjoyable way to get uh, into kind of a light, competitive gaming environment, which is it's really, really good. A great idea, I reckon, which is a good, uh, good thing to have added to this, to be honest. I think it's a great idea, and I reckon a lot more people should be getting on and, and having a crack at it because it is really fun. Uh, you do get your odd dickheads on there that... They're just wankers. Um, you know, I had a, I had a go there where I got told I wasn't playing the objective. Uh, I got 40 and 9, and I had uh, 10 captures and, I think, 15 defends. I don't know how I wasn't playing the objective, but okay, your call, mate, whatever. Um, I'm pretty sure he reported me as well, but um, I've got the gameplay there. I'm just... Hopefully, uh, theatre mode does come back. This was recorded live. As most of you would probably know, theatre mode is down at the moment due to a 10th prestige hack. Uh, with the theatre mode, uh, which sucks ass. There's always someone that's just willing to fuck it up for everyone else. So, yeah, good on yous. It just fucking annoys me when people hack shit like that. So you destroy the games and it's a pain in the ass. Anyways, getting off topic. I will be posting a bit more of this kind of gameplay. I do want to try and get um, the rest of the 667 guys. I don't know if, you've pro if they might be watching. I don't know. But maybe get a crew of six guys going and uh, get into the team deathmatch or even the... The other Champions League and just get into that and start raping on that. I mean, it's a completely different. Um, you, all your guns are unlocked from the start, so you can use whatever gun with any attachments, whatever you want, which is great. And uh, you can just go to town. I reckon it'd be really good to have a good group of guys in and actually having a good crack at it. I reckon it'd be a great fun and a yeah, good good little uh, taste of what it would be like to be in a competitive league. So you know. As far as I'm concerned, I think it's a great idea. I'm loving it. Uh, you're going to see a bit more of this from me, hopefully. Um, a little bit more hardcore too. And, yeah, you're going to see, guys, look. Honestly, my gaming is coming to a, a slight halt. I'm not enjoying uh, the COD games as much. Or I haven't found any enjoyment in too many games of late. So, there's a good chance that I'll uh, probably be giving gaming away, or, like, videos for a little while. And uh, you'll probably see a lot more motorbike videos and uh, stuff like that from me. Anyways, guys, leave me some feedback on what you think about the League game playlist. If you uh, like it, or if you haven't played it yet, or if you're keen on having a go, I really highly recommend doing it, because it is great fun. Anyways, guys, thanks very much for watching, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Cheers.